All right, everybody, we're back here with some more Fire Emblem. I told you we'd be back for this one. This chapter uh, kicked my ass last time, but now I have. Uh, I pretty much um, thought of a way to, to just go ahead and beat it with the setup that we have. I kind of had the right idea in the first place, but um, things just kind of needed to be switched around. I'll, I'll tell you what I mean in a second here. Uh, skip through all of this. All right. So the last time that we tried this chapter, we kind of had the Pegasus Knights go this way, which. Um, was kind of just as a result of both wanting to get the village and the shops here and because I forgot that um, the druids and shamans here have the lunatome which um, means that the pegasus knights can't just plow through here but I found that instead what I can do is just switch it around so that the pegasus knights go north instead and take on the whole the fuck ton of valkyries that we were having trouble with before they can take on those just fine um, Granted that I don't get status saved, and there's only one of them here, really. Like, yeah, the druid here can kind of go over and try to use sleep, but that's about it. And that's all they have to deal with, and that's ideal because they don't have the restore staff to help them. Uh, the other party will go to the west, and because there's so many of them, they can just try and player phase down all of the druids and shamans. And there's also not so many valkyries, and the ones up here, like, I don't think there are any level 14 valkyries, those are the really problematic ones, like, those are the ones that can, like, double some party members. Uh, these are all, like, level 8. I think all of the ones in the corner here are level 8 as well. So, um, not a whole lot of characters are doubling them still, but I'm also not getting doubled. Like, for example, the one up here, this one I think is level 14, yeah. Oh, and it didn't spawn with that much speed. Um, yeah, the way it works in Fire Emblem is that um, each time you like load the map, uh, it's not like they're not like set stats. Like the the enemies have growths, so um, the stats can be variable. Like this one has a uh, 23 speed, for example. Like this is one of the really dangerous ones. Uh, I don't know if they can spawn with 24. I think 23 is the limit there. But yeah, that's basically what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and set it up so that um, the Valkyries are going north. I'll go ahead and pause until I finish my preparations. Okay, that didn't take too, too long. Also, unfortunately, ah, man, this is where Boots would have really been handy in order to get Ninian into the battle uh, a little bit safer, because I have to use Ninian to put Barrier up on the two Falcon Knights, uh, turn one. So, unless I deliberately slow down for her to catch up, uh, she's really not going to be able to help on the west side. And the reason I don't have Boots is because Astol died trying to get them in Battle Before Dawn, which is, I mean, yeah, I think that's what the chapter's called, Battle Before Dawn, which is just really bad. But I decided that it was such a, like, I got good level ups, and I didn't have any other casualties, and I figured, you know, I'm so close to beating the game, it's just Astol. Um, it's not gonna make or break anything. But yeah, let's get into it. Yeah, we'll deploy Merlinus, Merlinus and he's actually kind of important because I'm gonna keep Hector here uh, until Vita comes. Uh, he might be a little bit, he would be useful in the west, but I also do like having, uh, it's a route chapter, so having him here to fend off the wyverns and the mages that'll come down here, as well as Vita, um, you're gonna have to do that anyway, so I figured why not just keep Hector here, he can pretty much take them all on, um, especially if Ninian is still, like, back here by the time they come. Alright, so we're gonna do the thing of, uh, using barrier, this will just lessen our chances of getting, uh, status. And that's actually kind of important in the way we're doing things now because it's only going to take them one or two turns to reach where the Berserk staff is um, located. And I also positioned Heath where he is just in case I want to send them up with them if they need help. Um, I think that's unlikely, but you know, just in case. Uh, let's just uh, move over here. Yeah, Javelin is fine. Move far enough up here. Oh, and she has the... Okay, I did give her the the Seraph robe. I kind of still wanted to give that to... I, I kind of still wanted to give that to Sane. I gave... I um, saved in a different file slot specifically for if I changed my mind. And this might be a situation where I changed my mind on... Because uh, Sane might actually need that to survive some hits over here because he doesn't have... Like, look at this. He gets 2 KO'd by the... Um, the Nosferatu guys, but he also one-shots them, so that's pretty good. Um, yeah, we'll just use Raven, get these guys the fuck out of here, and then we can use Sane, trade the weapon back. Uh, I guess I don't really need to, because I don't think they'll be in range of him. 
but you know, you can never be too sure. And then, oh, Kent one-shots too. I forget, his strength is really high, um, even compared to Sane's. But that's also because I gave him the energy drop from Lin mode. Uh, we'll just get this guy here. Keep keep Hector by the, uh, by the tent here. Merlinus is actually kind of important to be deployed here because um, the mages, I think, kill Hector, or they can if he doesn't dodge. Um, but oftentimes they go for Merlinus instead, and so that's uh, that's pretty good there. Yeah, because we're just gonna skip. You know those four mages over there? We're we're not gonna kill them with the Falconites. They they have to make use of their turns to get up there to where the Valkyries are, and uh, take care of business over there. Yeah, through those four Valkyries spawn. What do they got? I think one of them is level 14. Oh, okay, none of them are. Yeah, I think I think it's just this one, the one with the Berserk Staff. And luckily, it didn't spawn... Uh, oh, and this one as well. Luckily, one of them spawned with lower speed, meaning Farina can uh, actually double it. Since uh, it's, at level, it's got 25 speed, so that's pretty nice there. <clears throat> oh, nice, that's a kill. Mm, should I kill any of these monks along the way? Nah, I, I, I gotta make use. I gotta make use of my movement, and these monks are not really an issue. They're not threatening, really. So here, uh, this is where we kind of have to player phase a little bit because uh, these, guys, these guys have Luna. The ones up here, and like Luna is ridiculously accurate too. That's the other problem. Um, we can enemy phase these guys, but um, we're gonna kind of like group up every, everybody here. Maybe let some of the shamans come to us, and then um, go on the offensive there. Get Pent over here. Dance. Actually, now that I think about it, I'm not gonna I'm, I'm not gonna be a noob. I'm actually going to. Uh, well, first of all, I'll barrier, and I'll also just rescue drop. I didn't think of this because uh, I'm an idiot. I can just rescue drop minion to where. Um... Yeah, that's fine. I'll also be in range of the shaman. I can uh, get Raven, who's barriered up over here. Rescue drop. Yeah, that's, how you, that, that, that's some pro strats right there. To uh, use Ninian and also get her around uh, quicker. The idea is not to have like two people, especially not in range of this guy's. Um... Oh, he can only move here. So I actually could place someone at the like here in front of the bridge. Oh, oh, also the Valkyrie, though. That's going to be kind of a problem. In fact, the Valkyrie is in range of Ninian. Uh, is the... Uh, so is the Shaman. Okay. Kent, I think, has the higher resistance of the two, and the two have a support. I just don't want both the Shaman and um, the Valkyrie targeting Ninian. Okay, yeah, I'm not going to get doubled by... Actually, I think Kent only loses one speed from the Hand Axe. Okay. So as long as I'm here... Um, yeah, because now that the shaman can't reach her, and I think this is a flux shaman anyway. It's not a, it's not Luna. Only a couple, but yeah, this one has Luna, so this one's actually kind of dangerous, because uh, he can crit me. <laughs> I'll use javelins and not hand axes just for more avoid. All right, I can silence. I may as well use silence. Like, there's literally no other situation where that's where that's uh, remotely useful. Like, the Valkyries don't get hit by them. Neither do the druids really. Okay, and it's just Hector, I think. I may as well just move him on the forest tile. So we got mages. Farina owns all these monks here. Gets a javelin broke. Okay, so I, I could have just silenced the shaman without putting like Kent in range of uh, of the Valkyrie. Okay, uh, that uses Eclipse. Oh, actually, now that I think about it, <laughs> Ninian leveled up from that. Nice. And leveled Resistance, which is actually useful. Um, it's actually good that the now the, the Druid's holding um, Eclipse, so I can actually just go in and have somebody kill him, no problem. Oh yeah, this is a Sleep Staff, which I don't think he'll avoid because he's sane. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> My boy! Alright, 
So here the situation gets a little sticky because now I basically lost. Uh, oh wait, no. Does Pence? Uh, I wish Pence had the <laughs> the resource save in the situation because now um, Lucius is basically out of the the fight for this because he has to he has to restore um, Sane. Actually, I can just move him over here. Or mm, I, I need to prioritize just one shotting the guys of Luna. In fact, I think that's what I'm gonna do with. Uh, or I can do this. I can just like. Okay. All right. Here's what I'll do. Oh, you know what? I can also use Nini, Nini's Grace. That's also that's also real nice. That's actually, that's actually kind of clean. I, in this situation, I might prefer that over like dancing for somebody, even though that might be useful. I could also use Lucius to take another Luna or to take a Luna Shaman out of the fight with Silence. But I think I'm gonna go ahead and work on managing these two for now. Alright, which one of these is more threatening? Because if one of them has an L fire, I'd rather take her out first. Okay, that's fine. And then I think I can just elixir up with um, Farina. Maybe do some trading, give her... Yeah, do this. Well, actually, I'm gonna have to give it back anyway, but... Because um... I don't want Farina to die. Uh, yeah. Actually, man. Eh... Oh, really? Did I get doubled by that? Why? Oh, this is the level... Um, this might be the level... Uh, shit. Uh, do I risk this? Fuck. Okay, I leveled speed, so I don't think this Valkyrie doubles me anymore. Oh, with the Brave Lands, it might. Oh, yeah, with the Brave Lands, I'm gonna get fucked. But I still have the plus five, um, I, I, yeah, I still got the plus five, uh, shit, that was, that was a bad move, that was a 66. I might actually, be, that might actually be a reset. It's still early on, so I'm not too concerned, but that sucks. That I might not, because I'm not going to dodge anything either. Yeah. Next turn, I guess I'll use the, the elixir, because I doubt all of the Valkyries can, no, like, four of them at most can get me. Although they might do the thing where, like, one gets in front after all of the other spots been filled and I just kill them. Eh, that'd be fine. Like, the Valkyries do, like, 3 damage to me. Even if they double, it's not that big of a deal. Alright, go for Sane here. Uh, is this a Luna guy? Oh, it's actually Nosferatu. That's um, Nosferatu. That's a threat also, because I think it's more accurate than Flux. Or it's not, but it does more damage, so I think I'll just get rid of him either way. Yeah, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Um, yeah, this guy's like one of the only people who can actually double the, uh, the Valkyrie, so that's good. Nice. Because if the Valkyries are not hitting him, then there's no way the Shamans will. Which one of you has Luna? This one has Luna. Gone. And yeah, I can like dance for- if I dance for- for- uh, oh wait, no, never mind, these guys will get- oh god. These guys are kind of scary, wait a minute. Hold on, regret. I might actually use Nini's Grace and just try and solo with, uh, he uh, Heath. Yeah, you know what, I might do that to block off the path and also- okay, so this is my strat right here. Oh shit, I didn't notice he was a slow, I should have healed him instead, never mind. How much does he take? Oh, <laughs> all right. <laughs> yeah, so my strategy is just to block off the path here and just fucking go on. Hey, he even got res and speed. <laughs> he got all the stats he needed. Boy was ready. He was ready. I think that's it, uh, right? Because it's just Hector now. Yeah. That man was ready. And he he can take on the heroes too. Because like, hey, go ahead and crit them all. <laughs> <laughs> Strats! And I don't have to worry about these guys. Nice! Yeah, this is no damage. Chink. Oh, do I not have... Oh, I had the Iron Sword equipped. That's why. Okay. That's fine. I don't think reinforcements even come for another turn. Uh, yeah, this guy goes after Sane. Yeah, that was some damage. Damn. I'm just waiting for the Shamans to... To go in. 
gone. Yeah, none of the reinforcements have Luna. At least not in this turn. Nice. Bam. Bam. Heath is a fucking monster. Oh, god, that's scary. What? Hey, 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 what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh my god, I got put to sleep. Farnum might die now. Yeah, it's... It's not looking good. You know what? I might have to, like, rescue and back off for now. Yeah, okay. Alright. So it's not looking good for Hugo Farina, but, uh... I can just- I can just fuck off over here. Actually, the Valkyries are still gonna get me. Oh, I can go this way and, like... Yeah, 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 yeah. I can go this way instead. Yeah, I don't think I'm in range of anyone but the Bolting guy right now. Yeah, I guess I'll just have to regroup and take them on later. That's gonna slow me down a lot, that, uh, god, that's- I've never- I, I've tried this strat a couple times before, like, I- I test ran, ran the first few turns. That's really rare that it hits me. Fuck. <laughs> that's not good. So there's more reinforcements here. Yeah, I don't think any of them have Luna, so we're pretty okay there. Uh, this is not a Valkyrie, this is a- yeah, we don't have to worry about this guy. So now we've got Lucius and, uh, Pence both in action right now, so... Damn, that's so much. But even, even if he crits me, I don't die. That's a lot of damage. <laughs> we don't have to worry about him for now. The Monk's not really a threat right now. Uh, will the Hand Axe finish him off? Nah. I think I'll just use, a uh, Steel Sword, yeah. That sounds fine. And I can let Raven probably handle this guy. Cause he, I don't think he even, like... Yeah, he doesn't kill, if anything. He's not doubling. Let's see how far these guys' range are. This, uh... Okay, they don't reach. Is this guy Luna? No, he's not Sparadu. Okay. He's probably not gonna hit me anyway. And I could easily kill that bandit before, you know, going anywhere else. Oh, I could even kill him with Pent. Oh, never mind. I guess he, uh, he's, that boy's got some resistance on him. Shit, man, he's really accurate. I just gotta make sure one more time that the... That none of these guys can reach me. I might just have, uh... Because, like, if I... Yeah, I'll have to dance for Lucius. So that this guy doesn't kill me afterwards. Can he crit? Nah, he can't. I don't even kill him with this. What? Shit, Raven, what's going on? Um, yeah, I'll have to like... Actually, this is probably better anyway, because I can get some chip in. I think it's 100 anyway, yeah. Go, go ahead. Go on. Dance for... Lucius first. I think they even have a support together anyway, so it's fine. Yeah, now we're n uh, nice and full. Why does why are Raven's weapons so weak? What the hell? Oh, I gave him the long sword so that he could like kill the the Valkyries. Okay, that makes sense. And it's more accurate than like uh, anything else. How does Hector do? Yeah, because like four of them attacking him could kill him. This is what I mean. So I just want to make sure he's not in range with the fourth one. Yeah, and I think I'm fine now. Unless one of them, this guy is Thunder, Thunder, Thunder. Okay, they all have Thunder, so. Uh, 33. If they all hit, then um, they do 33 damage to Hector. And as long as the fourth guy is not in range, I do not die at any circumstance. Uh, Alright, so let's see. I think it's just Hector now. Okay. Yeah, I, I think I just kept him there. That was the plan all along. Gone. Another heat level up. Let's oh my god. <laughs> this boy's gotta calm down. He's gonna start one-shotting Valkyries with the Horse Slayer. I think he has that, doesn't he? Okay, just massacre all of these guys. Oh, what? Did he not double or something? Oh, <laughs> these monks suck. <laughs> wow, he didn't even hit me. Nice. Hey, stop! Stop! <laughs> oh, shit, they're all gonna head over here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is not good. 
This ain't good at all. How close is the closest? Oh my god. You know what? I kind of want to like... I, I kind of want to use heat, heat to like just fucking solo all... Oh god, I really want to do it. I want a Ninian's Grace him. Barrier. I want to do it. I want to do it so bad. Yeah, boy! <laughs> well, he needs to get healed too. I don't think any of these guys have Luna, right? Yeah, they have Flux. I can just kill the just kill this guy real quick. I just want to make sure he has enough javelins, actually. No, I don't even have javelins. Oh, I need to. What I needed to do was. Um... Yeah, because I don't think he's gonna have enough javelins to get the job done. Maybe I should have done this with Raven instead, because he has higher avoid and speed anyway. Yeah, I probably should have done that instead. Because it's looking like these Valkyries are all gonna... And he has the Longsword, too, so... Yeah, I may as well kill this guy. Oh, I didn't even see what he got. He got Strength, though. So that's nice. I could also... Wait a minute. This guy... He still does that much with the... Oh, I didn't... I, I didn't mean to race him, right. I haven't done that yet. <laughs> uh... Yeah, get this boy out of here. He does way too much damage to me. And the druid's the strongest one out of all of them anyway. Like, these guys have half the magic that he does. And it only does nine. Wow. This is an absolute fucking massacre. He might have enough to chip them, because, like, he'll use four here and probably two here, and that's it. And he'll be on the mountain as well. Yeah. Oh, these guys, they reach Sane, though. And he doesn't have the support bonus with him. Sane might die. Man, that's really shitty that he... Uh, I can't get over how shitty that is, that he... um That Farina got slept, and then... Uh, see, the, the bad decision was me using the Brave Lance. It was probably because I missed out on a Void that this all happened in the first place. I can like try and do this, so at least they, at least those Valkyries probably might go for the uh, the Falconites instead. Okay, nice. I think they're gonna run out of space, so regardless. Yeah, they might block themselves off because a lot of them are attacking Ninian as well. So you know, Ninian being useful, saying avoiding. All right, I think he has a decent amount of luck, so he might just oh. <laughs> Hey! What? Oh, that was a bad decision. I don't know why I did that. I forgot. To, yeah, I forgot about the bolting guy completely. I think. Wow, he slept pants too. Oh, he's actually. So this actually like worked out mostly if I just hadn't like. How would the situation have looked? I mean, without without this whole crowd here, if it was just like the druids, um, maybe I could have come out of this. Yeah, definitely. Especially if I still had like, I need some more javelins on Heath. Like, I need to put all the javelins on Heath. All right, so we'll be back. Obviously, this is a failed attempt because we lost Farina, and we need Farina for um, for victory or death. So yeah, we'll be right back. All right, we're back, and this time we're in a situation where uh, Baron is not asleep because I actually I think I put her far away enough to avoid getting hit by the druid. Maybe uh, I kind of just fast forwarded through that. Okay, no, yeah, it's just way too big, but uh, I guess I just got lucky, um, or rather I gave I think I gave Farina her. Oh no, I didn't even I didn't even give her the weapon that wouldn't weigh her down. Uh, so I really did get lucky. My strat uh, initially to avoid that was to just give her the iron sword, give her a better chance of avoidance. If that's even how it works. I don't know if it's entirely on resistance or if it also has to do with speed and luck. But basically I got something good good going here. I decided to just go ahead and uh, get Hector up with this group, make it easier to enemy to um, player phase all these enemies over here. Because uh, we don't really care about Merlinus anyway. 
and uh, I mean Vida will come to us anyway as well so I thought it'd be just better to bring Hector along uh, and now for this uh, the next few turns gonna be a little tricky because I'm gonna probably get uh, they're gonna try and sleep me again if this druid decides not to come down here and sleep this group instead Berserk is also pretty scary at this point I want to go ahead and lure this Valkyrie down here soon if someone gets berserked, then I'm just gonna run the fuck away and hope for the best. Actually, if, if someone gets berserked, I lose because they they fall in range of this uh, sniper and then bam, gone. So uh, let's see what to do. I think I can just knock out two Valkyries right here with uh, Farina and uh, I'm trying to see which one. Oh, that's probably the level. Oh wait, no, this one just has higher speed. Yeah, because these spawn with... Oh, they spawn with really low speed. 18. I'm just trying to see which... Uh, which Valkyrie gives me the best chance of... Uh, oh, actually, this one has the best chance, but that puts me in range of the heroes. i got to watch out for that as well. Um, so I can't go here, really. Oh, wow, I missed. Of course. That's fine though, we're, we're knocking out those Valkyries, uh, Ken's a really low HP, Saiyan got slept, because of course he did. Get him the restore stave, uh, okay, these guys are not too far away, or they're not, they're not that close is what I meant to say, I meant to say the opposite of that, um, this Valkyrie needs to go, unfortunately, man, it's unfortunate that Heath is like so close to Okoing these guys with the Horse Slayer, but... Uh, yeah, just just short, short a couple points of strength, and I think the cap is like 27 anyway. I think am I about to, am I about to cap it or is it 28? I forget what the cap is for that. Oh, we have both brave weapons right now. I need to trade that one away soon, or I, I guess I could just use Ninian, but I prefer to use Ninian for Ninny's Grace. And then again, I'm not gonna have to enemy phase these guys until or player phase these guys, player and enemy phase these guys. I, I can only enemy phase when I. Um, use Ninny's Grace, really. And that's if they don't have Luna, which luckily the reinforcements are, uh, don't come with Luna usually. And uh, I can just... Can I hit this uh, this person with... Oh, that's actually pretty good, because I have the barrier, I forgot. But oh my god, those hit rates! Jesus. You know what? I think it's better to just... Uh, yeah, go with the Brave Sword here. Raven's high skill is really going to come through. Uh, right here. Oh, Heath doesn't have barrier? Who does then? Did no one get- Oh, it was just Heath who got barrier. Never mind. I thought I could go in and get some chip with the others, but I guess it's just gonna be Raven this time. I'm trying to hit with the Brave Sword. Even that's not great. But if I can just hit with one, thank you. That gives me a lot of confidence. Uh, I think I'll just- Let me just make sure I'm not in range of any of these Valkyries. When killing, uh... Yeah, I'll just kill the Troubadour there. I don't think that's going to cost me too much. Bam. Oh, wow. <laughs> that's actually kind of funny. Does this person have Luna? No. Still got Nosferatu, which that doesn't actually matter too much because uh, even with a crit, Luna actually doesn't kill. Like, you know, get some calcs. Get some nice, nice calcs. I think I'd rather kill this guy because if I get hit by the the shaman, I just want to make sure I don't die. 32. It's gonna do like 25 to me. I wouldn't have died either way, but you know, yeah, you, you can never be too sure. You can never be too sure. All right. So this enemy phase is pretty important because I have to not get status. Uh, oh wow, I didn't realize that uh, that shaman was in range. I could have actually been dangerous if they both decided to target Heath. But I think the the, the druid's gonna prefer to just, um, they might just prefer to eclipse anyway. So I'm not too worried about that. Oh wow, I, I don't get hit though, so I don't have to waste turn healing. I only have one physical left. I only had. Oh wow, I've never seen that before. They didn't go for bolting. That's so odd and nice. Okay, I was hoping that they would go for the sleep on this party instead. Yeah, 
Yeah, I like this. Oh, pff, okay, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. Doesn't hurt to have a. Oh, whoa. Was that the Berserk? No, okay, no, it's not. I was kind of afraid that was the Berserk uh, Valkyrie. That would have been bad. Am I safe to move up? I don't. I actually don't want to overextend. Because that gives the. What it does is it gives the. The Berserk user better staff accuracy, and I don't want to. I don't want to go for that. So I think I, I'm nice and comfortable here. And you know what? I'll just. Uh... Oh wow! Okay, I thought I was. Uh... I thought she was lower health, but never mind. I'm tired of this guy. Get him the fuck out of here. I don't need to use an elixir yet, but now I actually have to like be a little bit conservative here about these uh, these Valkyries. Oh, they actually. They can kill um, Sane if I don't restore him, which I don't even... Okay, no, I am in range. Nice. So I actually do... I actually did need to move him there because uh, otherwise I died. I can... The Brigand's probably going to attack instead of... Uh, it's going to prioritize attacking instead of uh, going for the village, so I'm fine there. These Valkyries, 17, 18. Okay, neither of them double... Okay, yeah, he can use Hand Axes without... Uh, I'm getting slowed down. So neither of those Valkyries double him. So that's pretty neat. I just want to make sure that both of them don't go for him. Then again, he actually has like surprisingly good resistance. Like he has 8? That's a good amount in FE8. These guys do what? 23 damage? There's no way he dies. In... Oh, he might die after Flux actually. Oh right, they physics. They physics. This guy, like, not even Sane, I think, dies to two of them. Oh, actually, no, he does. Because they do 21 damage to him. Or, 20. Man, Sane is ass. <laughs> what? When when was Sane so shit? Um, Raven's gonna need healing in a little bit. So I don't even want to... Let's see how much of these... How much these guys do. Oh, they don't actually do much because of... Uh, oh, right, because of the... Uh, probably because of the... the the barrier. I can't talk. The barrier is still in effect. I just want to figure out what I want to do about these uh, these Valkyries up here because they're they're actually kind of dangerous. What I uh, one thing I could do is like Nini's Grace uh, Sane after he one shots this uh, this guy over here, and maybe barrier up somebody else to take care of the uh, the second shaman, like maybe Hector or something. Because Hector, well, Hector can take two hits anyway. And he doesn't get doubled. So I think I'm actually fine, just uh... Because what I can do is I can Silver Axe. Right here. And then, like... Switch his weapon with Kent. Go in with Sane as well. Kill this guy. Does Kent die to two... I don't think he does. He's like barely has enough health to survive getting hit by the Valkyries, I think. They might even just prioritize healing. 23 attack. Oh, and this one has 21. So like, he's gonna get hit with the... <laughs> Time to do, ma to, to do math. He's gonna get hit with a 17. Okay, yeah, he lives for sure. He lives for sure. Actually, I'll give him this hand X. That might be better. Wait, whoops. And, uh, I'll actually put him here because I don't want him to get hit by the, the shamans and the, uh... Speaking of which, Ninian is actually going to get hit by both, which is pretty funny. Uh, but Ninian, like, pff, yeah, she's fine. Look at her, look at her speed and luck. She's so... Uh, she's fine. Oh, wait a minute, is Sane even in range of the Valkyries anymore? Oh, he's not even in range of the second one anymore, but he's in range of, uh these guys and I'm not gonna be able to kill them all at once I could just barrier him to be honest oh I'm not even in range of that wow I thought I was I'll probably just use pen to maybe physic someone instead because uh, Raven needs some healing yeah Raven still has his barrier left over so I'm gonna actually 
Are there reinforcements? Not even. Not even. I really don't think that Brigand's a threat. But... I might want to heal. Like, how much damage would he do to... Uh, 21? Oh, he does, like, nothing. I, I, I think I still want a Physic, though, just in case. I've learned not to take chances with this game, and yeah, that was my last physic right there. Gone. Eh, I may as well put- now that I have, like, the, the health to survive everything, I may as well put myself in a situation to be in range of the Valkyries as well. The Bandit doesn't reach Sane. These guys do, so I'm gonna prioritize killing these guys. Yep, I think that's the plan. I don't think they reach an Indian either. <laughs> That's pitiful damage. Oh, I actually didn't even kill him because <laughs> my javelin broke. Nice. Oh yeah, these guys are just gonna try and fail to kill uh, Merlinus. Oh wow, I'm actually going for parents. He can miss. Yeah, never mind. It's a shame that I don't think uh, Florina leveled speed, otherwise she might have been able to double. Yeah, we're just taking out all these Valkyries. Although you can see the, the barrier is starting to wear off. Oh, pfft. <laughs> boy. Oh, that sucks, actually. I would have liked to hit that. Jesus, they just don't stop. They just don't stop. I'm gonna have to Elixir up pretty soon. Because at base, like, they're taking... 5 to... 8 damage. Yeah, we're a plus, uh... Actually, I think I'd rather just... Oh, wait, no. Oh, my God. Wait. I... I'm, I'm actually gonna back off a little bit here. Just because of... Yeah, just because of this druid being in range all of a sudden. I'm gonna back off a little bit. Do like this. For example. Can the druid reach me if I... Oh, it definitely can all of these uh, Valkyries are weakened anyway now, even though I guess they might heal each other. So I'm not going to take the chance, I'm just going to... We're going to back off here. I don't even... I have two uses of my, my Javelin, that's pretty funny. Once it sees that it can't reach over here... It's out of sleep too, which is nice. Yeah, once it sees that it can't reach here... Luckily these guys can though, because they're, they're all going to suicide on Florida probably, because she's at low health. Or like, quote unquote, low health. I'm expecting uh, the, this druid to just want to go back over here. Oh yeah, don't put anybody in this spot. It's going to want to come back over here, and then I can just kill it with all of these guys. So I'm going to be good there. How much does Hector do? Oh my god, no accuracy, what happened? My guy. I think I'll just use Hector then to clean up over here. Yeah, how about that? Is this... Oh, it's on a forest tile, that's why. I'll just use Ninian and, uh... Do that. Oh, I just realized these heroes are in range as well. So... If, uh, Raven gets hurt, I'm gonna have to heal him. Uh, yeah, that's probably what I'm, have to, what I'm gonna have to do. Jesus... Oh, I have to, yeah, I have to, <laughs> I have to restore Pen because he's got my, that's my last restore, by the way, but he has the barrier, which if I'm going to put Heath like here, I'm going to need to, oh, I can't even do that. Oh, he'll reach anyway, and the bandit, like I said, is not an issue, it's, a, it's such a non-problem. Yeah, that bandit is not even, like... <sighs> I'm fine with him being there. Even if he hits, like, Ninian, I can prevent that pretty easily. Yeah, we're gonna do this. 
And then he's gonna do this. Oh, I just realized if I um, I'll I, I can rescue Raven if he gets hurt doing this because okay, they can't reach him. Neither can they. Shamans, I doubt it. Yeah, no problem. I'm just I'm just trying to see if he actually dies. He takes 28. Oh, he's gonna take like. 20 a pop, so if he does get hurt, he might die if they both hit. Oh, okay. I didn't realize he was this accurate with the Brave Sword, so we're fine there. Nice, he even got the fence, just to rub it in. How much speed does he lose with the Brave Sword? Oh, actually, not a lot. He only loses like three. So he's at 23 speed here. He's still even. I don't even think I. Yeah, I'm fine. I, I, I considered like rescuing him, but I think I'm fine here. I can even elixir Hector so that he's so that he's useful uh, next turn. As in he won't die to a counter hit or anything like that. I could like take the liberty of killing this bandit now and like rescuing with the other cavalier, but I don't think that's necessary. Yeah, I really don't think that's necessary. Just double checking that none of these guys can reach the, the grass tile. Actually, I may want to... Okay, no, they can't reach Pent either. Because I was going to say if the bandit, like, attacks Pent and then all the druids do, that could be an issue as well, but not even. Yeah, not even. I'm, we're, we're Gucci. We're fine. I could even... Do, I could just do something like this to give Sane the support bonus or whatever. I spent way too much time on that turn. There was really not much to think about. Yeah, like I said, that bandit, non-issue. These these guys are probably gone too, because yeah, they double. They get doubled. Jeez, Raven is such a monster. Hey, let's get some res. Okay, that's fine. We got speed. Oh my god, he is such a monster. God damn. Oh yeah, these mages. They just they just keep trying. Wow, okay, that did a lot. I thought it did a good chunk. But now the druid's gone. That was my main concern. That was Eclipse, even if that hit, it's like, like the whole thing with Eclipse is that it does uh, exactly half damage every time. Let's get some speed, come on. Hey, oh my god, good levels. Good levels. Good ass levels. Now, I actually want to get out of here because I'm afraid of getting berserked now. Like, I'm actually seriously scared of getting berserked. Nice. Unfortunately, I still can't go in and like go ham because the sniper is keeping me in check. I think I'm gonna fuck off now, honestly, because um, yeah, I'm gonna fuck off because uh, I think these are the last round of I I've put enough pressure off of myself that I feel comfortable. Like, what is this? Turn five or something? Turn seven? At this point, um. I have enough barriers, like all the status saves are pretty much used. Oh, wait a minute. Oh shit, this is actually, this can be kind of a problem if these guys start going ham. Uh, cause I'm out of restore staves. Maybe I should have waited out a couple of those. And it's a route map, so it's not like I can just seize the throne with, uh, somebody by beating Linus. Or Linus, however you want to say that. In this case, at 21 speed, there's no way, even with a 27 speed full arena, that I can double that. Yeah, there's no way. I still want to fuck off and help out over here, though. While also not being in range of uh, this druid. On the way there, I could probably just uh, kill some of the... Kill the mages over there. I think that's the last, like, huge round of reinforcements from that corner. And they're so far away that I feel comfortable, like, rejoining the group. As for these guys, uh, who's at low HP? Who's status? I'm legit gonna have to, like, have somebody bait the status staves. Probably Lucius. Lucius has 24, 24 res. I think I'll do that. And maybe try and silence a few of them as well. But let me check the furthest... Particularly the Berserk. I don't care about the other ones. Just let, please, Lord, let me not get Berserked. Oh, wait, what am I doing? 
No, wait, that's not what I want to do. Wait, what? Why does it keep showing me the staff rate? I don't understand. That was weird. Anyway. I just want to check the Berserk range just in case, because I'm actually getting pretty close to it. I am pretty paranoid about that. I'll actually save my silence uses. I'll just go for a mend. Where's the druid? I don't want to lose track of her because she can- Oh yeah, because if I put somebody here for example... Oh, I can't even put them here. Or like, all of this is her attack range. Alright, good to know. Good to know indeed. Okay, that's out of her attack range. Good, good. Hey, look at that. Hector being useful. On the way there, I can get that. I can actually get that village later. I'm fine. We good, we good. Oh, I actually didn't no-code that. I just, <laughs> I just ended up critting. Oh, you know what I haven't tried yet? Hold on, let me try this shit. This is something I've been wanting to try for a while now. Yeah, I had these extra items with me. Yeah, whatever. I'll give you the Thor's Eye just in case you, for some reason, knock something out with bolting. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's whatever. But I could try, like... Oh, man, you know, I missed my chance. It was the Mang strat of, like, berserking the heroes over here. Oh, I can berserk the sniper. Hold on. What's my range on this? Let me see. It's magic time uh, halved by two. Maybe Lucius can do it. Because Lucius, I think, has higher magic than... Uh... Yeah, because this goes 11 spaces. Pence only goes nine. So it's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So if I get Lucius, like, over here, I can actually berserk this. <laughs> I can have him, like, kill all of the fucking Valkyries. That's amazing. I'm going to try that in a minute. But for now, I'm going to lay low a little bit. I could probably, like, start, um, I'm actually thinking about rescue dropping, uh, Lucius into range. I think he was here, and then, uh, oh wait, can I, can I go there safely? I can, okay. Drop. And there it is. I don't think using bolting on the... The druid right now is um, like what, what crits what like 20 uh 28 no <laughs> 27 that's my fucking math right there eh oh i can mend somebody oh it's just raven okay i think i'll bury her up lucius in a minute so you can start baiting the, the valkyries more effectively oh yeah these guys yeah, Merlinus is gone. Oh, Vital might be coming soon, if it's turn 7. Okay, use Eclipse. Oh, what's this? Sleep? Oh shit, it's Silence. That's not good. Now yeah, these Valkyries are coming here. That's fine. More Valkyries. We got Luna, because otherwise, if, if, if we don't got Luna over here, then I'm just gonna go ham with Lucius, honestly. I'm so tired of this. What do you got? Do you have, like, Purge or something? No, just Divine. That's fine. Yeah, it's actually good that these, uh... That these, uh, Valkyries are starting to chase me. In fact, I might just fight them here, because... Yeah, if they keep following me, I think I'm just going to fight them down here, honestly. And I'm actually going to start sending Hector back, because, uh, Vita's coming soon.
We're near the starting point anyway, and we're gonna start killing just all of these guys. And if the Valkyries keep following us, we can have Vito fight them too. I'm so afraid to like player phase here because that fucking Berserk staff, bro. It's just keeping me from doing anything. None of them have, uh... Yeah, Lucius, I think, even doubles all of them. So we're just gonna retreat. That's the strat. Because I'm pretty sure the, the Druid's the main concern, honestly. Everybody else is just kind of meh. Don't care about them. Because the Druid puts out, like... Just so much magic. Gone. 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 Yeah, I've really been underestimating or underutilizing Lucius as a combat unit. The monks are not a threat. So I don't care if they come over here. Oh, hi. Really? It landed? That's some bullshit, bro. I can't believe that landed. Okay, luckily Vita hasn't showed up yet. That's actually pretty good for me. That's kind of whack. That that landed. And you know the drill here. We're going to start killing Valkyries left and right. Well, or so I thought. I guess not. Uh, I almost called her Vanessa. <laughs> I've been playing FE8 too. Florina is gonna kill the Valkyries more like. Just wanna make sure that nobody important's in range here. Yeah, so I wanna place them more on like this side. I'll do like this. I wanna get this 20 speed one out of the way. Really now? Really now we're gonna do that? I can't even physic because, well, one, I've run out, and two, it's just... God, this is just a bad time, honestly. Fuck out of here. I'm so tired of you. I'm so tired of these guys. It's actually pretty good to get at least one of these guys in range. Uh, one of these guys being, meaning Raven. So that they, so that they don't all go for Farina and she dies. Which at this point is kind of likely to happen because she didn't land that. God, that's annoying. How many of them will double her? A lot of them because it's weighing her down by eight. So yeah, all of them double. Yeah, I think I think Byron is dead, guys. <sighs> because she didn't land that shit. Oh wait, hold on, hold on. She might not be dead. If only two of them hit her, she might not be dead. Hey, your boy, he's coming through. What's up? What's good? Oh, yeah, and the, the fucking, um... The druid's gone, too. So, gone. He's putting in some work for the team. He's doing it for the team. Although, I think the... Yeah, this guy can kind of reach him, so... Actually, uh... I don't want to get rid of him now. God, he's so strong. Why? Why are you so strong? Give me that support bonus now, please. Otherwise, he's gonna be the one dying. And yeah, like, honestly, I got sounds on both of these guys. That's just terrible luck right there. I can't even do my strat now of, like... Uh, oh, nice, nice. <laughs> That's pretty nice. They went for the... They're going for the wrong people. Still, if both of the Valkyries go for Kant, he's gonna die. Okay, it's just going for Eclipse. Oh my god, all these Valkyries. But hey, now Farina doesn't die. It's pretty, pretty neat. 
And more reinforcements, great. That's just great. Vita, can you please come soon? <laughs> These guys are gonna... Oh my god, I'm getting destroyed. Hey, Heath, you gotta give me all, all your, um... Do you even have the elixir already? Wait, no, I didn't use it. I didn't use it yet. My god, this is not looking good, guys. Well, it's looking better than it could be. Like, all we're, all we're getting now is, like, the, the monk reinforcements. So at least that's good. I can't even heal because I don't have... <sighs> How long are you guys silenced for? Three and two. At least that's good. Holy cow, that's so bad. Like, it's pretty much a full retreat. Except for Florina. Basically. And Florina barely has uh, javelins. Oh, I forgot to trade myself uh, some more javelins, speaking of which. I'm at least gonna give myself some avoid, man. Fuck that. Oh, nice. I actually uh, killed this. Kill this one, nice. Pretty nice. How many of them reach heat though? A lot of them, more than one that I would like. Oh, I could just rejoin, but uh, actually I'm just gonna stay here. Heath, come on. Come on, you got, oh, he has plus three res. He has plus three res, it's all good. It's all good. This guy reaches Kent. So that's obviously not good. I didn't, I didn't bring healing items with Ninian. That was a bad idea. Definitely a bad idea. Oh, you know what I can do? I just thought of this too. Can Pent rescue? No, he can't. He can't rescue Raven. I don't think Lucius can either. Because I was thinking of doing is like drawing in all of these guys and using like a, a nice uh, Ninny's, Ninian's Graze, you know, that, all, that shit always works. I could still do that and still get like the support bonus. The problem is with Kent's lower HP, I don't even know if he lives. I also don't want to get, I don't want to get him crit by the fucking uh, Bishop because the Bishop has... Yeah, the Vine has 10 crit for some reason, so I think Sane's actually the better fit for that job. Because what is he going to get hit by? Okay. Uh, I also don't want to rescue, because I'm afraid I might have to use Raven to player phase in a little bit. So I guess I'm just not getting the, the, the support bonus. Wait, no, no, no! I... <laughs> oh, fucking moron. I didn't Ninian's Grace like I meant to. Just give it to me. Okay. <laughs> that somehow worked out. Before moving in Hector, I'm actually just gonna... <laughs> I don't know how I survived that. But I did. And now I can use uh, Ninian to do nothing apparently. How many Valkyries are left? Three. Alright. I can do this. I can do this. Right? Yeah, I, I can. I can just, uh... I think I, I have enough characters to player phase this without... Uh, granted that I don't miss. Because what I can do is do something like this. <sighs> Come on, Kent, you have to do better than that. Let me see if uh, Heath one-shots. He does. I'm actually going to use Ninian on him instead. This guy has 32 HP, so he probably dies to the Horse Slayer as well. Uh, how much... Oh god, he's not Shine, so he has 13. He, has, he does 10 damage to Sane. That's crazy. 
like he's gonna die if I go for this right here, unless I rescue him. So I'm actually gonna use Farina first. Well, we, we we know what happened the last time I used the Brave Land, so we're not gonna make we're not gonna make that mistake. Oh, I don't have javelins, of course. Of course I don't. Please tell me you double. Thank you. That's a start. So now Farina can finish this one off. Justice. All right. So we're actually looking pretty nice. We're, we're looking nice. I can actually just leave this one for last, honestly, that enemy. Sane. We got Kent over here. Just making sure that we're not in range here because we're actually getting kind of close to his range. I still want to... I can still Berserk him and have him kill the Berserk... Uh, <laughs> uh, have him kill the Berserk uh, Valkyrie. That would be some nice justice right there. God, I hate this chapter. Oh, I didn't even see the druid there. Holy shit. I could have missed that. I didn't realize the, that it was still alive. Oh, it's the silence one. Right, right. Which means I'm still probably going to get uh, fucked by it in a minute with another silence. I'm actually going to take back my brave sword here and kind of sneak over here uh, just in case I need to kill that... Uh, that druid next turn. I, I, it doesn't reach me. There's no way. I just checked its range. Okay, it's being dumb and using Eclipse, so now I can actually kill- Oh my god. No, 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 no. Alright, boys. Alright, boys. And more reinforcements? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Are you fucking- ah! Oh, I actually killed. Nice. Gone. Fuck out of here, boy. Yeah. Unfortunately, um, I'll barely be in Berserk range, actually, so you know what? I can barrier up just so I don't get fucking Berserked and then uh, kill this old lady over here. Because I think that's a female druid, right? That's the... Yeah, it's the unique sprite for those. Yeah, both of those druids are dead. I'm in purge range as well, so I should be careful about that. I don't think two purges yet, they don't kill me. Wait a minute, does 15? Well, I gotta dodge one. That's just the only way. That's just the only way this is gonna go. Or I can rescue him. Uh, Ninian, what's your range here? Yeah, Heath's not, Heath's not doing anything. He really isn't. I could have them, um, uh, or Farina, go and uh, get Sane out of there. Because he can actually die now to the purges. Which is pretty whack. Okay, as long as you're not in range of the, uh, the bishop, we're good. Vite is going to be coming soon over here as long, uh, along with a bunch of wyverns, so I think I'm going to have Heath and Hector take care of that here. It's going to come soon, I just know it is. Yeah, this entire situation is uh, Florin is to take care of. Oh nice, he put himself in range to kill. Very nice. Finally. <laughs> Finally Lucius is uh, back back with us and I killed the uh, well I there's still a couple of uh, silence Valkyries over there but they don't have nearly as much magic as um... oh, what can I attack hello oh okay okay never mind but now I can do what I've been wanting to do for a little bit for a little bit now is actually uh... yeah 89 that's a good amount but let me just make sure one more time I'm outside of his range just in case I miss I'm in longbow range actually, but that shouldn't even come close to killing. Even with silver bow, it doesn't one shot Lucius. Because Lucius has like five defense. <laughs> nice five. Ooh, let's let's get it. What's what's good, buddy? <laughs> yeah boy! 
So now, why don't you go and uh, kill, uh, well, nothing, because uh, uh, I could still actually go for Lucius, so I'm actually just going to rescue him, take him back here. I forgot the Valkyrie is not there anymore. I don't know. He could still, like, maybe go uh, this way and uh, kill the, some of the uh, some of the Valkyries for me. That'd be, that'd be nice. That'd be real nice. Gone. Uh, reinforcements have not come yet, though. Oddly enough. How much do these guys do? Barely anything. All the same, though, it's good to get them down here. And, um, you know, just have them get killed by Raven and, uh, and Florina. What turn, what turn am I on? 13. That's not that bad. I need to go get this village anyway. And maybe buy some shit. So now all we've really got are these, uh, these scary Valkyries up here. Which I can bait down with Lucius. As well as, uh, Linus. The two Purge Bishops. Which they haven't really attacked yet. I guess they haven't felt confident in attacking. Uh, Heather and, uh... He Heath and... I called him Heather. Heath and Hector chilling down here. I think I can probably just kill, um... Who am I gonna kill Linus with? That's another thing I've been contemplating. Probably I'm probably my mages because he has the light brand and that targets resistance. So that's a good deal there. He doesn't move, um, as far as I know. Despite it being a route map. I'll just end it. Oh the Valkyries have moved out. Alright, they had enough. Hey! Hey! Hey boy! Yeah! That's really fun. <laughs> That's amazing. All right, so uh, Vita has come at last. And this guy's gone totally berserk. I'm just gonna keep. Uh, he's probably gonna kill all these reinforcements too. That's what I like to see. I am gonna move uh, Raven out of here though, because uh, he's starting to become in range. Okay, I'm not in long range, but just in case. If he could walk in a straight line. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. Okay. There's no way then. Holy shit, I'm out of weapons. Never mind. I didn't realize that. How am I out of weapons? <laughs> Give me this killing edge real quick. Talk to Vita. There's gonna be a bunch of wyvern reinforcements there. So, um... Yeah, we're going to be using Heath and Vita quite a bit there. These are not the only ones. These are far from them. And I actually want to keep them under control so that they don't pressure our party up here. Wait a minute. Why isn't there... Oh, these are all physics. Right. Wait, why is their staff range so short all of a sudden? Oh, there we go. Yeah, like I said, I just want to get out of the. I, I just want to get out of people's way right now because. Uh, because if not, I'll end up uh, getting having someone berserked. You know, that's that's never good. I'll mend Sane first, because he's got less HP, or less durability in general. And yeah, the other reason is just, like, because I'm moving back a little bit, I don't want the Wyverns catching up to me. So, what is that? <gasps> It'll be so funny if the sniper moves first. Oh, they, they don't even attack him! That's amazing! Hey, hey buddy! <laughs> Catch that shit! <laughs> oh my god, that's great. Which one did he kill? Please tell me he killed the Berserk. <gasps> he actually killed the <laughs> He killed the Berserk Valkyrie. Oh my god. I'm so done. That's amazing. I actually don't even have to worry about retreating all that much anymore now that that now that the, the Valkyrie I was most scared of is gone. I'm so cool with that. I just have to make sure not to be in the sniper's range, and I can actually just send Florina in to, to go ham right now. Because the worst that can happen is, well, 
Ah, uh, she could still get slept. So I think I'm gonna barrier her up anyway. Give her some fucking glances, damn. I didn't realize she was so low. I could always Ninian's Grace her as well, or Ninian's Grace somebody like, I don't know, uh, Raven, but nah. Lucius would also be a good candidate if uh, he wasn't at a weapon triangle advantage. Disadvantage, I mean. Yeah, so like, uh, I can take out all of these guys over here. Yeah, that's his real movement because the, the enemies don't impede it. So I'm good there. Yeah, I got those two uses done. Not even this Valkyrie can really target me. So I'm actually just, uh, I'm actually fine. Just uh, waiting here. Get my hand axe on. Yeah. Get the hand axe on deck. Uh, I'll dance. Yeah, whatever. All right, because I haven't I haven't healed uh, Kent. Nice. We're coming up at the end, boys. <laughs> After you know those attempts last time, it was looking kind of bleak. And this time, for that matter. Oh, what? Do I not have a- what? Hello? Do I not, did I not have a weapon equipped? Does silence do that? Does it de-equip you? Oh, I might have taken- Yeah, I think I did when I- I, I de-equipped him when I traded the items back to him. I did a surprising amount of nothing. Oh, hey. <laughs> yeah, boy. Nice, nice. Oh yeah, there's the sleep. Whatever, at this point. <laughs> Yo, that never gets old. That's fantastic. Gone. Alright, you've out you've outlived your usefulness. Uh Farina is gonna take care of you all now. I was gonna say with her trusty Brave Lands, but it hasn't been so trusty now, has it? Hey, they don't double her. Oh, because it has Elfire, probably. That might be a heavy tome for, for it. And it's at full health anyway, so I'm fine with that. We're fine with that. I don't have Restore anyway, <laughs> so I'm going to have to live with that, I guess. I think those are the last enemies. Yeah. Look at that. Uh, who needs EXP? Technically, I guess I'll round out my EXP gain by... Doing this. Nice speed, nice <laughs> nice defense. Okay. It took me a long time though. It took me 16 turns, and now I'm, I am actually gonna get Hector. Oh wait, no, I don't have to get Hector moving. It's not uh it's not C's. I forgot about that. I'll get everybody else moving. Particularly, I actually want Heath to get a move on. Because Hector and Viter are fine here. Like, Hector's not gonna die or anything. I'll actually have Raven come down here because, uh... Yeah, Raven... Well, if I trade him... I have to trade him an axe, though. He actually does take damage from enemies, so... It might be good to... Not put him at risk in the... as For as many turns as possible. Mo I, I say this mostly because it's gonna take him a while to get to, um... Linus. Then again, I could just ferry him. Because he is actually kind of good against Linus. Like, Linus tends to be kind of hard to hit because he has high speed and luck. Um, like, relative to just normal enemies. And uh, Raven having, you know, high skill and all that. But I think... I think I'll just send him down here. No, I have all three of them down there. That's, that should be enough. And I have... Um, now I have a uh, Bolting. So I can actually just use that as well to take care of uh, Linus or whittle him down. These three should be fine here. First thing I'll do is, I think I'll just send in the Pegasus Knights first, because they take like no damage from 
Yeah, especially Farina takes no damage from Purge. The Purge is 23 on each. 23 and 25. Even far enough, like, between the two of those, it's gonna take, like, 20 damage. Uh, not a whole lot indeed. And I can just barrier up again. So that's gonna be even less of an issue. Yeah, we'll just get everybody moving up there. I don't- nobody dies to, like, two purges. Honestly. Well, actually... Kent, I guess might. The math says otherwise, but I'm paranoid right now, so uh, we bury her up. I think Pence right now has like S in staves. Oh wait, no, he doesn't. Not yet. Not yet. But yeah, we're coming up on the end. In fact, um, if I hurry up here, I can route the map before any more. Uh, that's two damage. That's just pathetic. I could route the map before any more of this. Because these reinforcements come for a while. And we're on turn like 18 already. Sub 20 would be nice. If I can manage it. Hector couldn't double this guy, so I'll take care of him. I'll also go ahead and take this opportunity. Kill these guys. Bam. I could also just help them with uh, Florina and Farina at range. Well, what I can't. Oh shit, I forgot to go to the village. Right, I need to go there with. Uh... I'll have. I guess I'll have Kent go down there. Boost his movement with Ninian. I'll have him go down there, buy items. I'll skip all of that, of course. I almost forgot to do that. Nice. I don't- is there a secret shop here? No, no, that's in victory or death. I'm tripping. That was a pretty poor use of the Brave Lands, but whatever. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's the, the FE6 reference, I forgot that uh, this guy was here. Oh yeah, because he gives you warp, that's really good. Uh, warp is really essential for victory or death, so yeah, we're definitely going to do that. Oh right, Merlin! <laughs> Merlin has died, so I have to drop something I get the shit out of here. I forgot about that. Um, I do no damage with the, uh, the Javelin, but he also doesn't do any damage with Whitebrand. How much damage will I take up close? Oh, not as much as I thought. Oh, I can't crit him. Okay. He also can't, uh... Right, right, the light brand doesn't crit. Still, I was not expecting it to do that little. Florina has, like, 7 defense. Does it proc off of, uh... Or does it hit resistance no matter what, then? It seems like it, because that's, like, no damage. Huh. That's interesting. Yeah, I just need to start whittling away at him a little bit there. Get Pent over there. Preferably, I want some characters who don't crit. Like, Pent actually might have a chance to crit here. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, I keep forgetting. Yeah, Linus has the one item that prevents crits. But yeah, just start working away at that. Um, I'll have time before uh, before Kent gets to the, the shops. And he regenerates, so... Like, he has a lot of HP. Uh, like, I think he's over the cap for any character. The cap in these games is like 60 HP. For some reason, like, some characters just cheat. Like, even uh, characters that are supposed to be normal humans, like... Uh, <laughs> Like, uh, Linus. He just has 61 HP for some reason, I guess. I don't need door keys. Uh, I haven't really used that many. Um, I would like to clear the, the... I would like to clear the chapter this turn, so... I think I'll just go to the armor instead. That's what I really need. I think I have enough staves. Uh, well, I don't have physics anymore, but I'll get those in victory or death. Yeah, what I need are these weapons, bro. 
Even though they don't sell like hand axes or javelins, which sucks ass. Yeah, just give me all this. I'm gonna pause it until <laughs> until we come back from all this shopping. Okay, never mind. Because I I forgot that Merlina's died, so I can't actually send anything to the convoy, which is pretty ass. Uh, in that case, I should have gotten Heath moving a little bit because he has a bunch of inventory space and things to sell. Um, but I still managed to get a couple of silvers in each category. And I just sold the silver card because I don't need it at this point. Like, I have 60,000 gold. There's no reason for that shit. I'll go ahead and send Vida as well because he, she also has a ton of um, inventory space. We're on turn 20 though. So, I mean, it'll just be a, a, a matter of like... I mean, if I kill Linus this turn, or Linus, whatever it's pronounced, if I kill him this this turn, then, you know, it is what it is. I clear the chapter and I don't get as many items. Nice, leveling strip. God, such good level ups. Good job. Okay, she won't die. I don't think anybody dies at this point. Oh shit! <laughs> Wait a second! Oh shit! <laughs> he might die, yeah. How much damage does Lucius take? Probably nothing. Yeah, that's what I thought. I think there's a good chance I'm gonna end it this turn. Because even if uh, Raven fails to kill, which he has two chances to, uh, I can still heal him. Yeah, there it is. So that was, uh, that was Cog of Destiny, probably the hardest chapter in this entire game. Um, <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed, and you might, you guys might not see this game again, who knows. Maybe I'll play Victory or Death with you guys, because that's another, it's not a hard chapter, but it's a cool chapter to, like, play. Um, hopefully I can make it through alright, because I don't have a whole lot of weapons or shit, because I didn't, I didn't manage to do my extreme shopping because of, uh, Merlina's dying. But I mean, I needed Hector on that side, he definitely contributed a little bit to the the player phasing. But, uh, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> I'll get by with my resources, I guess. Uh, I'll see you guys next time.